So Steve asked me if I would show him how I have my mainsail rigged. Um, sometimes getting all the little creases and stuff out of these sails takes a little bit of putzing around. So I'll kind of walk you through what I've done. Um, feel like I get good sail shape on both tacks, and uh, but it's been it's taken a little bit of time. So I'm going to start at the top. Um, I have a simple lashings to the yard. I have them lashed individually. Ooh, I see one's missing. Um, and then I just tension it with one end or the other. And uh, I found just a little bit of, you can see there's a little bit of bend to that yard. So there is some give in the yard. It used to be more flexible and I needed to stiffen it up. So I added a sleeve to that, fiberglass sleeve. And that helped a bit. If you come down to this end of the yard, you'll see a line that's lashed through the yard around the mast. And I'm going to show you how that helps me, especially when I have the sail reefed and when I'm bringing it down. Um, coming down, my um, you can see how my snotter is rigged. I've got a block in the end of uh, the sprit boom, and then I have another small block. Uh, lashed off to the mast. The line goes down through the deck and I use turning blocks to run my lines back here. I haven't found that I have any problem getting enough tension on the rig by having it in back and it's a lot more convenient. I'm gonna go in the boat now. If you see the mizzen missing, that's just because I haven't put it on yet. So here's my downhaul. What I did with the downhaul is the plans call for this to be attached to the deck right about here where my finger is. And um, I do find I get a little, I get a nicer looking sail when I move this, the end of the yard to the leeward side of the boat. Um, and I'll do that on a long tack. On short tacks, I don't bother. I'm not actually sure how much it impacts performance, but it does make the sail look better. My uh, downhaul is here, so that runs forward. With a three to one, I can get really good tension on that and pull that down. And then the one thing, I, I for years I had my, my out haul, or my Snyder line, excuse me, I had that just running back to a block on the boom. I really like this arrangement where I've got this right here. Then when I'm off on a run and the boom's off the boat, I can still really easily adjust that. The other line you'll see is this, which is my uh, topping lift, uh, lazy jacks, call it what you will. It's simply a line that runs up to a block at the top of the mast. and down under and up the other side. When I'm coming in for the day, um, I will loosen my snotter, uh, let that go slack, I make sure my main sheet's got a little slack in it, and then I can take this, I have a second hook up here, I can 